beer o'clock on Real Love Craft Beer. I'm at the Barcelona Beer Festival 2018 and I have a, a, an Imperial Stout, 10% ABV uh, from Marina Craft Beer. Here's a look at the bottle. So we're sitting here, we're doing a bit of a speed, uh, it's not speed dating, it's kind of speed drinking beer. So we get to speak to the head breweries just over there, um, speaking to other people. Um, but of course we do video, we don't do write, written blogs, so they're sitting there with their handbooks, which is absolutely fine. But I, I thought, let's crack the camera out, let's get a beer review then. So, uh, first beer of the day, Imperial Stout, uh, Saturday morning, 10am, and it's called Cream Mat, Imperial Stout. Please look at the beer. Uh, it's a jet black beer in the glass. Uh, we got a it's kind of a, it was a small one finger tan coloured head. Let's get a little bit more in just to just to show you the head. There you go. So yeah, jet black, good lacing, good carbonation, chasing the beer up the head, the head of the glass. It serves a little bit cold, it's come out of a fridge, so it's just a little bit too cold for an imperial stout. Um, I'm picking up some vinous qualities in the aroma. Yes, but the thing is, it's not a little bit of cocoa. Uh, definitely some red wine. I actually asked the head brewer if it was aged in red wine barrels. Uh, it's very vinous, but he said no, it, it, it's not. But it's got a fantastic aroma, there's some vanilla coming through, some cocoa, your chocolate, your coffee, your caramel. Cheers! First, day, first beer of the day, 10am. 10% Imperial stuff. Here we go. It's lovely. It's a very nice imperial stout. Um, it's got a good mouthfeel, a nice, nice kind of thick, cloyny mouthfeel, which you want for an imperial stout. You're picking up the flavours, the chocolate, the coffee, the caramel. It, it, it is vinous. Come and, come and have a chat. Come and have a chat, let me move the camera. So just talking about your Imperial style, um looks very nice. Uh, I explained it, it, it's a little bit cold yeah. in being served, but really nice Imperial style. Um, what was your name? My um, name is Pep, it's Giuseppe. Pep and uh, from Marina, just Marina. go up just a little bit. There we go, Marina. Uh, Marina Craft Beer. Um, so how many different beers do you do? Uh, uh, IPAs, pale ales? Yeah, uh, I, feel I have saisons. I have a uh, grape ale. Too. Yeah, yeah. I have a, uh, I did the first beer uh, with a chef. I brewed the first beer, uh, Blackton beer in the world. Wow, okay. <laughs> okay, fantastic. Well, I really like that. Good mouthfeel, lots of vinous quality coming through. Um, I asked you if it was a red, aged in red wine barrels? No, no. But it's very... Expensive. It's the combo of malts and yeah. uh, maybe, maybe the pepper has red pepper compote yeah. and uh, Moscovado sugar. Maybe this combination give this this. It's lovely, really nice imperial stuff. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thanks for that. Cheers. Okay, so I'm going to rate the beer. I like it enough. It's, it's, it's quite difficult because I, I think it would be it would be so much better if it was a little bit warmer. Um, so I'm going to gauge it. Through my beer experience, through drinking so many Imperial Stouts, I'm going to say if it was just in my mind, if it was warmer, I think it would be a 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Real Old Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Uh, check out more videos from the Barcelona Beer Festival 2018 from us. Um, yeah, comment, subscribe, stone the crows and cheers.